the amount of wings in the game has over doubled. There are now a grand total of 36 available wings for the PC version. The wings which you can see on screen right now are ranked from worst to best. They will also add a timestamp for each wing in the description below for you to pick. So I'm here to show you how to get all the wings in Terraria. A little note here before we start, you must be in harmony to create any of the wings seen in the video. Obtain the soul flight from the wireworms which can fly high up in the sky around the floating islands. You will need a grand total of 300 soul flight to create all the wings. First off on the list are angel and demon wings. You can craft the angel wings with 20 soul of flight, 10 feathers, and 25 soul of light at a mithril or orichalicum anvil. To craft the demon wings, you just switch out the 25 soul of light with 25 soul of night. These souls can be acquired in either underground hollow or crimson slash corruption, depending on the world. Next up are the tasty fin wings. The fin wings are a quest reward from the angler. To obtain the angler, you must first find him at either side of your oceans and have him move into a house. From there, he gives you daily fishing quests, which you can complete for rewards. The chance of getting the fin wings increase after how many quests you have completed. The more quests, the higher chance. The jetpack is a viable item from the steam bunker who will move into your house once you defeated a mechanical boss. The jetpack is only sold on a vaccine moon, which is between a new moon to a full moon and costs 40 gold. For the bee wings, you will need to acquire a tattered bee wing, which is dropped by the moss hornets in the underground jungle. Combine it with 20 soul of flight at an anvil to create the wings. Next up are fabulous butterfly wings. To make the butterfly wings, you need to find a rare moth in the underground jungle and acquire some butterfly dust from it. Then simply combine it with 20 soul of flight at an anvil. If you want to cosplay as Tinkerbell or take revenge on Navi, then this is the item for you. To make the fairy wings, you simply need to obtain 100 pixel dust and 20 soul of flight and craft them at an anvil. If you want to honor Sir Christopher Lee with style or fight as the Dark Knight, then you should get a hold of the bat wings. To create the bat wings, you simply need to kill vampires during a solar eclipse and get the hold of one of their precious bat wings. Then you combine it with 20 solar flight at an anvil once more. The solar eclipse are now a summonable event with a solar tablet. Next on the list is the not as cool but still fashionable harpy wings. The harpy wings are created with a giant harp feather, which you can obtain for killing harpies. Then combine the giant harp feather with 20 solar flight at an anvil once again. The giant harper feather is the only wing material item which you can obtain before hard mode. So if you want to be early out for hard mode, this is the wings for you. Now onto the least effective wings, the bone wings. Once in hard mode, you can get a hold of a bone feather when you are in the hard mode dungeon by killing armor bones of any kind. Then you simply combine it with 20 soul of flight at an anvil. Now onto the developer wings. These wings are only obtainable in the expert mode of the game. The wings are rare drop from the hard mode boss's treasure bags, and all wings have a 5% chance of dropping. All the wings have the same stats and abilities, except Leisure's barrier platform and Eurasor's spell, which can fly horizontally by holding down the space and the down key at the same time. The exceptionally big Mothron wings are a rare drop on the Mothron miniboss during a solar eclipse. The leaf wings are purchasable from the witch doctor who moves in once you defeated the queen bee. If you make a house for him in the hard mode jungle, he will be available to sail with the leaf wings at night for one platinum coin. The ice called the frozen wings you can create with an ice feather, which is a rare drop from the ice golem, which only spawns in snow biomes during a snowstorm. A snowstorm is the equivalent of rain in other biomes. Once I acquire the feather, you simply combine it with 20 solar flight at an anvil once again. The very hot flame wings are craftable with a fire feather, which is a rare drop from the red devils in the underworld. Combine it with 20 soul of flight at an anvil and you go to sell some wings. To obtain the shady specter wings, you will need a total of 60 chlorified ore, which can only mine in the underground jungle, and smelt them at either an adamantium or titanium forge. Then you'll need to get 5 ectoplasm, which you can get from killing skeletons in a dungeon, then smelt the 10 chlorophyll bars with the 5 ectoplasm to make 10 spectre bars. Now spice up the bars with 20 soul of light at an anvil and you go to self the spectre wings. To create the beetle wings, you'll need a total of 8 beetle husks, which is dropped by the golem in the lizard temple. 
you spawn the golem with power cells, which can either obtain from mobs or chests within the temple. Once I got the hold of your beetle husk, and combine them with 20 solo flight at the level once again. When you get a hold of this item, you won't need roads anymore. To craft the hoverboard, you'll need a total of 108 glorified ore, 270 glowing mushrooms,